Thank you, Lord. Woo! Brothers of the Woods Outdoors. I'm Dave Bennell. And I'm Jim Davis. And it's season five here at Brothers of the Woods Outdoors. Can you believe it, buddy? I tell you what, it has been a heck of a ride. It's been a great time. And hey, we actually got some new team members this year, but we'll introduce you to their hunts as we go along. Up first, we're headed to Jackson County, West Virginia to our good friend Gary Shepherds. And I'm on the gun and Dave's on the camera. That's right, and it's opening morning, so let's get right to the hunt. Hey guys, welcome to Brothers of the Woods Outdoors. Tomorrow is the day that we look forward to. Oh. Other than opening day of deer season, tomorrow's the opening day of spring gobbler season in West Virginia. And once again, we're in Jackson County hunting with Gary Shepard. <laughs> Glad to have what, you back. <laughs> Glad to be back. You know, last year with COVID, oh. uh, we had to bring a camper. You know, we didn't stay at the house. It, we, it was all discombobulated last year, but you know, we've been vaccinated. We're back to normal pretty much. Yeah. And we're out here roosting this evening. Yeah, it mm -hmm. feels good, Gary Shepard. Be standing elbow to elbow instead of six feet. Yeah, yeah exactly. <laughs> yes, part. it does. And Jim's shooting first this year. That's right, baby. I'm on the gun and Dave's on the camera, so I'm pumped. We're actually on the farm that I killed my bird on uh, the second day last year. Yeah. And it's, it's about... Uh, <laughs> It's 15 time. minutes after 8, we're going to try to roost one right now. So let's let's give it a rip and see if we can locate one. Not yet. It's still a little bit early. Got the dog fired up over there. <laughs> Can you give him another one? Yeah, hit him one more time. Last year. Yeah. yeah. Exact same spot. I mean, in the exact same tree. The exact same probably. Spot. I think you'll probably have the same outcome in the morning. I hope so. I think so. Hey, uh, Gary that even means... went in uh, <laughs> earlier this week and put a blind up yeah. where we had our blind last year. So, uh, yeah, you're set. You're ready. I tell you what, I'm excited. I hope he killed one right off the roost. Yeah, because you want me to get on the camera and you want to be on the gun. That's right. <laughs> no doubt. It's just good to be back in Jackson County. It's great to roost one. We're pumped up for tomorrow morning, so stick with us. and We're going to bring you the action right here on Brothers of the Woods Outdoors. It is opening day in spring gobbler season. Dave and I are excited, as we always are, as we have been since we was kids in turkey hunting. Uh, last night we were able to put one to bed and uh, that's always a good thing. Uh, we're actually hunting the same area that I hunted last year with David where I killed mine. So we know the area, uh, we're excited. So come along with us this morning in Jackson County, West Virginia, and let's get some gobblers on the ground.
When it comes to business, we all have areas of specialty, but there are times when we need guidance. We need someone to come along and show us the most creative and environmentally safe way to navigate our engineering challenges. That's where we come in. CEC stands for Civil and Environmental Consultants. You show us the problem, we'll provide you with the solution. Visit wearecec.com. Big firm capabilities, small firm culture. Hey guys, my name is Tanner Burns. I'm the owner and operator of Full Draw Taxidermy in Buchanan, West Virginia. We specialize in wild turkey taxidermy, so I hope you'll consider us for some of your mounts this spring. You can check out pictures of our work on Facebook and Instagram and follow along with us this spring. Uh, good luck this hunting season and God bless. It's time to upgrade your motorcade during the President's Day event at Country Club Chrysler. Explore the history-making 4x4 capability of Jeep. They're made for West Virginia winters. Join the new Ram Revolution. Country Club has your next truck and the one after that. Don't forget to ask about special orders. Get your new car, truck, or SUV exactly how you want it. Country Club Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram. Presidential service always. Our temporary location is routes 19 and 98 south of Clarksburg. Why would you want to go anywhere else? Hey, if you'd like to follow along with the Brothers of the Woods Outdoors team throughout the entire year, be sure to check us out on all our social media outlets. Brothers of the Woods Outdoors is brought to you by Mahindra of Clarksburg, your home of the world's number one selling tractor. I see, I see something. That's him, that's him on the ground.
Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Dave, for being my cameraman, buddy. Two years in a row in the same spot. Oh, man, did he put on a show for us this morning. I'm literally in shock right now. I feel, Thank you, Jesus, for that bird. Jackson County, West Virginia has been good to us. I'll tell you that right now. I cannot tell you how many Jackson County flips I've put on gobblers here. That apex ammo right there, I'm pretty sure I just destroyed that gobbler. Whew, thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Hey, guys, we got it done in Jackson County, West Virginia. Another textbook off the roost hunt day. Oh, uh, right off the roost opening day. We put this bird to bed last night. Jim, I believe he was in the same tree he was last year. Not only was he in the same tree, I'm <laughs> betting this was the guy's wingman last year. We had two come right to the decoys last year. This year he was a single. I'm thinking this is the same bird that was with mine last year. I believe you're right, Jim. And I tell you, this bird came down early. Yes. It was dark in the woods. I said, I see movement. And Jim said, I think that's him. He's coming to the meta. He was, and I tell you, the hens were cutting it up back there like crazy, oh. and I told Dave, I said, we might be in trouble. I believe he walked right past the hens, and he came right, right to where he hung up there. Yeah, and he was sizing up the yep. strutter decoy, and once he decided, I can take that decoy, yeah, he when came he, on Yeah, when he broke to the, to the decoy, man, my heart was <laughs> pounding out of my throat, and I was, I, one time I asked him, are you on him, and we let him walk around the decoy a few times, and I said, I'm going to take him. And I tell you what, I put the Jackson County flip on another Jackson County gobbler, Thank you, Lord, for another great hunt with my best friend, David. Amen. And thank you very much for watching Brothers of the Woods Outdoors. Man, Jim, you got to love it when a textbook hunt comes together. We put that bird to bed last night. We caught him in right off the roost, buddy. And you put a tag on one opening morning. Opening morning, the Jackson County flip. I tell you what, Dave, when we were filming the interview for my hunt, another gobbler behind us opened up. You know, we looked at each other. I grabbed the camera, grabbed the decoys. Now I'm on the camera, Dave's on the gun, and we're headed that way. But up first is this week's tip of the week. This week's tip, we're going to discuss setup and cover. When choosing your setup, always make sure to have cover behind you, preferably something wider than you. This could be a big oak tree or simply a briar patch. Because nine times out of 10, if you're set up out in the open, even if you're using decoys, that gobbler is gonna spot you and your hunt is over. And for us running and gunners, if you're out late morning, strike up a gobbler and he's close by, simply land down on the ground, flat on your belly, you'll get the job done. And I am Eli Gain, and that is your CEC tip of the week. Many West Virginians know me as an avid outdoorsman and a strong supporter of your Second Amendment right to bear arms. Another right that I'm passionate about is an American worker's right to a safe workplace. The law requires employers to provide their employees with working conditions free of known dangers. If you are injured by a known danger in the workplace, call us. Warner Law Offices. Small firm, big results. Jake from State Farm. I would like to formally extend my gratitude for the Russell rate on my insurance. Do you mean surprisingly great rates from State Farm? I don't believe in accepting help, but I'll make an exception. Here's the deal, Russell. There's no special rate. These prices are for everyone. Consider a square. I made that from memory. I know your face that well. For surprisingly great rates and great service, call State Farm agent Brad Wild in Dodgers County today. Like a good neighbor, State Farm is there. D. Reynolds Gun Range, your go-to location for the shooting sports. Fun for the whole family. Open Wednesday through Sunday. Enjoy multi-station trap shooting, pistol range, long range shooting out to 400 yards, indoor climate control benches, target camera system, archery range with elevated stand. Monthly and yearly memberships are available at the outdoor store. Make sure to check out the new and used guns while you're there. D. Reynolds Gun Range, your home for the shooting sports. With the shortage of real estate today, never settle for just listing your property. You need the competition of auction that Joe Arpile can bring. 
When we were called to sell the contents of the Shepherd home, we learned that they were advised to list it for $385,000. They chose Joe Arpaio Auctions and we sold it for $539,000. Call 855 Joe Will today to sell yours. Hi, I'm Todd Linker from Linker Tax Service. We do accounting, tax, payroll, and more. If you need someone to prepare your taxes for you or your business this year, stop by or give us a call 304-657-2860. We do taxes. Brothers of the Woods Outdoors is brought to you by Mahindra of Clarksburg, your home of the world's number one selling tractor. All right, guys, well, listen. Jim killed one right off the roost. We went up here to do the closing interview and one gobbled. So we came back and got the decoys. Now we're going to head that direction. Hopefully he's hot and lonely up there. So come on. He sounds like he might be walking away a little away from us, but he'll probably turn around and come back. He heard it. He'll see if he comes up here anywhere, he's gonna see the, the decoy. If we just do some pause and listen to him, because he's a, he's hot. Well, oh, he's yeah, he's coming. He's coming. He's coming. You have to be tough to be the world's number one selling farm tractor. Mahindra tractors are tough thanks to more built-in weight so they can safely pull flex-wing mowers and rescue neighbors stuck in the mud. And you're tough too. 
You haul feed and pull a float on your hometown parade. Let's pray. And still make it to supper. Now that's tough. Sounds like we have a lot in common. Mahindra, the official tractor of tough. When it comes to business, we all have areas of specialty, but there are times when we need guidance. We need someone to come along and show us the most creative and environmentally safe way to navigate our engineering challenges. That's where we come in. CEC stands for Civil and Environmental Consultants. You show us the problem, we'll provide you with the solution. Visit wearecec.com. Big firm capabilities, small firm culture. It's time to upgrade your motorcade during the President's Day event at Country Club Chrysler. Explore the history-making 4x4 capability of Jeep. They're made for West Virginia winters. Join the new Ram Revolution. Country Club has your next truck and the one after that. Don't forget to ask about special orders. Get your new car, truck, or SUV exactly how you want it. Country Club Chrysler Dodge Jeep Ram. Presidential service always. Our temporary location is routes 19 and 98 south of Clarksburg. Why would you want to go anywhere else? Brothers of the Woods Outdoors is brought to you by Mahindra of Clarksburg and these fine sponsors. Closed captioning has been brought to you by Civil and Environmental Consultants Incorporated. We knew it was a risk, but we had to take it. 
you know, we're kind of sitting out here in the open. We were really hoping that the, the strutter would take all this focus to that. But as soon as he looked over here and saw us, he was gone. You know, I could have shot him, but it wouldn't have been a good video. So, hey, let's move on to the next one and check that one off. But, hey, we played the game right. We finally sweet-talked him into coming up here and coming through that gap. And, hey, that's all we can do. So, come on, let's just move right on to the next one. It's early. Ten after eight, so we got plenty of time. Come on. Man, Jim, it's been a long time since we've been busted like that. I tell you what, and it didn't take him long, but we were set up in a vulnerable position with the camera to get the video. That's the only place we had a chance to get that video and kill that gobbler, Jim. So we did it, but hey, he won that day. He sure did. But up next, we got two exciting hunts for you. First off, we're going to head out with pro staffer Gary Stevens on a self film hunt, and he kills a great gobbler in Doddridge County. And then we're going to head out with new team member Gabe Martin, and he has a guest in Tyler County, Jim. Hey, in the meantime, please follow along with us on our Facebook, Instagram, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and our Carbon TV channels where you can watch all of our hunts anytime. And as always, thank you for watching Brothers of the Woods Outdoors.